Hi, everybody. So I'm headed out tonight. I'm going to an Emmy party. I wanted to show you a night makeup look courtesy of Denica. She's gonna show us how you can do, kind of transition your look from day to night. For tonight, we're actually gonna do a strong lip. Come along. This thing is really the best. I know. So this like wakes up the skin, so massage. it makes everything kind of like back up to the surface. So it's good for puffing, it's good for penetrating eye cream into the skin. And this is called the Foreo, and it's amazing. It's kind of relaxing and soothing. And then I always like to go upwards towards the hairline all around the face as well. When in doubt, <laughs> use sex toys to <laughs> get rid of under eye circles. <laughs> So I started out with the YSL Touche mm, Pot Tint. My favorite. When you want a little more coverage for maybe an evening event or when you're gonna be photographed, it's good to have a little extra layer, but you don't wanna really just start by blobbing on like a whole bunch. So if you go by thin layers, it kind of just builds with the skin and it's a little softer. I started out with like a tinted a tint and then I put a light foundation over that. Ooh, wait, let me see this tint. See, I don't have this one. For the foundation, put this on, Ooh. which makes it a shimmer to the skin. Oh yes. So like That's it just it. does like all before over. foundation. I put it like mm. all here, all mm. here, all here. It's literally called flawless filter. Literally, let's see. But you can't flawless. just do that. You have to put that underneath the foundation. Right. That would be a little that aggressive gives you, by itself. That you gives might you want the, a little yeah, sun yeah. to diffuse. You could throw this on top of anything and just make it. Pizzazzies. Yeah. To add a little um, sheen to the lid. And are you using cream or powder? It's actually um, a mousse to powder, so Ooh. it's kind of a little bit of both. It's like it gives it a little shimmer. Like you yeah. can literally do this a mascara and it's more night. Totally. Than just having like a yes. little light eyeshadow. I act like I actually do this to myself. Ah! I do. You do. So we decided to not do a full strip, so I'm gonna be putting individuals in now. Full strip can be um, too dramatic sometimes. That can really change a look from day to night, is doing a good lash. strip lash, but because we're doing a strong lip, we decided to do a more natural eyelash. I start with short, and then I go in with extra short and medium, just to like fill in gaps. This color of lip is everything. Typically, you, you don't want too many focuses because then you lose focus. So I think a lot of people like feel like you got to be kind of mindful, which I agree. Um, so if you're going to do a really bold lip like this, if you had a really bold eye, it would be a lot of bold. And so I think this is like a good way to kind of balance it out, where you still have a little bit of drama, but like you don't have a lot. Hi, guys. Going to the Emmy party. Hope you enjoyed.